Welcome back to Nancy Drew the Deadly Device, episode four. Today, we are going to knock out some of these tasks and meet the day people, we, which will include Ryan and Mason, I believe. So let's head on out. Um, oh, I wonder if we can snoop gray space while he's out. Yeah, he seems like the type that would lock his door. That that, that makes sense. I, I get it. Let's head upstairs. This is what I was talking about. Here's some good music. It's exciting. Gives us meaning and hope and energy to move forward. Oh, look, it's open now. That's great. Oh, that must be Ryan. Whoa. I'm so sorry about that. Are we cool? Um, yes. Good. I was really hoping you'd be the type not to freak out about something like that. Not that you shouldn't. It's reasonable to freak out after a near-death experience. Not that that was super <laughs> near-death, but you know, closer than what you get walking through most doors. It's okay. I'm fine. Good. I had a whole argument prepared about labs and the risks of working with machinery and the importance of forgiveness. Do you want me to hit all the bullet points? No. That's not necessary. Are you sure? I practiced. No, I, I get it. I'm Ryan. <laughs> okay. Uh, first things first, let's cut off this girl's coffee supply. What do you do at the lab? The part was responsible for Nico Seth's missing. Do you know where it went? Well, let's, let's start nice before we start accusing her of stealing things. What do things. you do at the lab? I'm so sorry, but I have to ask why you're here. Why are you here? I'm Nancy Drew. I'm here to do due diligence for a potential new owner. I'm sorry. I'm an adult, and there's nothing funny about what you just said. Whoa! Wait! Back to the information. We're getting a new owner? Maybe, but first I need to ask some intrusive questions. Oh. I know you've <laughs> gotten enough of this, I really do, but it's my job. I've done worse things for my job. <laughs> like what? That's creepy. I build tools. They're not always used in a good way. What do you mean by that? I couldn't tell you about it if I wanted to. Confidentiality. Who do you think killed Nico? Who do you think killed Nico? A little part of me thinks it's Gray. Me too. Why? I'm a little scared of him. He's not scary at all, any reason in particular. Me too, yeah, me too. <sighs> me too. You and me are terror twins. Let's not call Those ourselves two that. Those a strange relationship. They fought constantly, not sure why. Hmm. The part that was responsible for Nico's death is missing. Do you know where it went? No. Are you sure? You sound like you're not telling me something. I destroyed it. It's gone. Why destroy it? Because I made it! You know what? I need you to leave me alone right now. Go, please. Okay. So sorry. Hope I didn't offend you. Art Brute. Okay. Random colorful piece of paper. I'll take it. Why not? This could help getting into the lab. Yes, it sure could. Key card. I wonder what it's doing in there. Alright. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, well. Security office, do not remove. Oh, there's an O there on that. Th okay. Cool. Uh, anything else we can look at while we're here? Maybe? Oh, a bike. Is this your motorcycle? It's my sweet ride! But it's not done yet. But I'm working on it. You know, this girl's starting to remind me of a girl I went to high school with. What's up? You're okay talking to me I now? better get going. Later. Later indeed. Yeah, there's this girl in high school named Andy, and she was very much like that girl. 
We recently became Facebook friends after not seeing each other for years. Anyway, fun inside into the life of Sarah. Let's talk to Mason. And I wonder if he's as guarded about Ellie's space as she is about his. If it looks like I'm busy, that means I'm busy. What are you working on? Man. It's immensely complicated. Get a postgrad in advanced math and electrical engineering, then I'll explain it to you. Put it in layman's terms. Fine. There's this shiny magic that lives in the power lines, and it's dangerous and sly like a fox. And I'm using math to trick it into leaving the power lines, without accidentally making everyone die. That sounds like you're working on the wireless transmission of electricity to me. If you want to put too fine a point on it, go ahead, stranger. Which brings me to my next point. Who am I? Please let the answer be something that justifies me kicking you out of my workspace. I'm People here are rude of a here. New potential Jeez. Owner. Wrong. No, excuse me. The men oh, are that's rude correct. here. No, I mean wrong answer for me. Not the answer I wanted to hear. Yeah, Gray, Mason, both kind of mean. Ellie and Ryan, I can get along with them. And that's just not because I'm a girl. I think you guys watching can agree with me. The men are being kind of poopy heads. Do you know why Ryan would want to hurt Nico? The police already asked the same thing. Well, what did you tell them? I said if I were to have killed Nico, it'd be because he stole my work. That Whoa, sounds like a motive. Hold on. It's just a for instance. Is it? Yes. That's because I think logically. I force myself to think from A to B to C and so on. Ryan is all over the place. For her, it's A to Zucchini, to that thing from TV, to maybe C, then on to some non-sequitur. I don't trust anyone I can't explain. Good luck getting a girlfriend, buddy. Who do you see on an average day? Just me. Sometimes Ryan. You ask a lot of questions. Ever thought of being a scientist? Sometimes. Good answer. The world needs more people with questions. And fewer people who are sure they have the answers. Alright. Did you see I beat your high score? Did you work Maybe I shouldn't be like, I beat your high score. Did you work directly with Nico? No one worked with Nico. We barely spoke to each other. That's the way he liked it. He practically lived in the lab. If he wanted to look at my work, he'd just root around in my hard drive. So he'd come in here when you were gone? No, he'd use the network. He'd just snoop in your files? That seems kind of annoying. Sure does. Not kind of. Entirely. It's unethical, and it allowed him to steal. Oh boy. What do you remember about the day Nico died? More than I care to. I imagine. Did anything stick out? Yes. The police. It was weird. One of us killed Nico, and here they were, talking about a basketball game. Like it was any other day. You said one of us. Why? Why not say someone? It's just an expression. It's not an expression I'm aware of. Don't be contrarian. It doesn't suit you. Um, I don't know what that word means. Don't think less of me, but I think you're being a little condescending and, as I said before, poopy head. Do you like Ryan? Let me save you some time. I don't like anyone. That can't be true. Observe, and I'll demonstrate. Other people. Okay, that was stupid. I can see why you don't like anyone, because no one likes you. It's a two-way street, buddy. You mentioned Nico stealing your work. Can you prove that? No. You must be pretty upset about that. Say what you really want to say. Did the police know your feelings about Nico? What a peculiar question. Do you have a peculiar answer? I do, in fact, have a peculiar answer. I actually told the police the truth. A more interesting question is how is Ryan still a free woman? Why shouldn't she be? In this case, the smoking gun is a miswired Tesla coil that she built. I suppose. Alright. Did you like dislike Nico? Did you dislike Nico? Very much so. 
Would you go as far as to say you hated Nico? I would go that far, and further. That guy was a jerk. That seems a little disrespectful, considering... Does it? Am I supposed to pretend he's great now that he's dead? Lots of jerks have died, and he's one of them. He's a dead, brilliant, jerk madman. The world would be much better off if he'd lived to share more of his intellect. But I selfishly am glad I'll never have to deal with him again. Well, I'm glad you said selfishly, because I was thinking the same thing. It seems strange to me that you could be so blasé about a murder. I deal with things on my own time. But if you are desperate to watch someone cry, Ellie's always available. Huh. It's not very nice, dude. What do you think of Ellie? She hates me so much that she switched to the night shift. Well, I would Come to too. think of it, she hates me so much I should actually feel a sense of accomplishment. Which I now do. There it is. What did you do that she dislikes you so much? Why do you assume it was me? <laughs> I took an educated guess. Oh, you know what? I took an educated guess. I took an educated guess. I did too. Still couldn't figure it out. But the fact remains, we are not besties, as she likes to say. We are worsties. Worsties. I don't know about you guys, but I think we should work that into our vernacular. Besties and worsties. What's so special about What's Tesla? What's so special about Tesla? If you have to ask that, you haven't done your research. I'll have to agree with you there. I mean, He's pretty you, amazing. What brought you here? The work. I turned down Los Alamos in a tenure track position to be here. Most people don't know this, but the majority of Tesla's work was confiscated by the FBI. Why? Could be he was designing weapons. Could be he had a breakthrough that threatened the energy magnates. Don't know. It's all been hidden. What matters is, there's a little bit still here. I always suspected Ooh. Nico had some squirreled away, and I'd be able to find it. But either he didn't, or I couldn't. All right. Oh, so many questions. Okay. You said you were searching for Nico's work. Did you ever look into Nico's personal things? You said you were searching for Nico's work. Did you ever look in Nico's personal things? Of course I looked. Of course. That, that's it? That's going to be the end of the conversation? Okay. Can you tell me a little bit about Gray? Can you tell me a little bit about Gray? He always gives me an industrial-sized portion of the creeps. The only that's person who ever liked it. Gray was Nico. And I think he just liked keeping Gray around to scare everyone away from his work. Did he try to scare you away from Nico's work? No. He tried to scare me away from my own work. What does that mean? He was Nico's heavy. I figured he'd leave once the police gave the all clear. Trust me, if he's still here, he's up to something. Your boss would be smart to get rid of him. All right. Gray, another one for Gray. What was Nico working on before he died? What was Nico died? working on before he died? There wasn't a name for it yet, officially. It was basically wireless energy transfer. That was helpful for you. So how about you tell me something about your boss? Uh -oh. I'm sorry, I can't. Confidential. Smooth. What are you doing? I want you to tell me what you know. But I can't tell if you're a pushover or not. Not. Ah, efficiency. One of the rare graces of a post manner society. Alright. Alright, let's taunt him about this game. Did you see? I beat your high score. Yes. If fighting is sure to result in victory, then you must fight. Sun Tzu compels me to take you down. Prepare yourself, opponent. Oh, wow. You are kind of a nerd. Okay. I'll let you go. Goodbye. Goodbye. All right. Let's see if he uh, gets all up on me about looking at Ellie's desk. What are you doing? What are you doing? What right. are you doing? I guess we're physically unable to go in there when he says, What are you doing? Is there anything else in here new, maybe, that we could pick up? No? All right. Let's head on out. Take a look at our checklist and see what we've done. Can't check that off yet. Alright. Did that. We've met everyone. 
Investigate the login irregularity from the night of the murder. Oh, there's my timer. Finish going through the task list and we'll call it a day. Snoop security booth. Nope, nope. Video file, Mason. Nope. That's done. We've explored the tech workshop and, oh, that'll be a good starting point for next time. We will use a key card to get past a locked door. Any locked door. We'll probably use it to try to get into the lab. We'll see what happens. So, that's it for this week. Thank you for watching Nancy Drew, The Deadly Device, Episode 4. I'm Sarah. If you enjoyed the episode, please give me a like or a comment, and I'll keep making these. Thank you for watching, and have a fabulous day!